Snappers, it's Jordan with the Gray. Welcome back to another exciting episode of Pokemon Yellow Dice Lock. Last episode, we spent pretty much the whole episode trying to get to Celadon City from Lavender. That route ended up being pretty full of trainers, etc. Uh, so it took us almost the entire episode to get here uh, to Celadon. And then we did our roll, which I'll remind you guys stated we had to switch our battle style from shift to set. Actually, well, the, the rule just says you toggle it. So if it was already set, we'd switch it back to shift, etc. Um, but yeah, so we've done our roll here for, for Celadon City. We don't have to do another roll today, hopefully. Um, but we are going to be taking care of Celadon City proper, as well as the gym. I figured we might as well knock out the gym today. Uh, so we're going to go ahead and do that uh, as well. Um, first off, though, let's go ahead and take some time. Let's explore Celadon City a little bit. I want to see... I do have the ability to get through here. Let me go ahead and have Sari cut through here. Now wait, is this a route? Do we have a route? Is this a route? Route 16. We do actually have to do a roll today. There we go. So that... I, I lied to you guys. I apologize. So 1 through 40, let's generate. We get a 30 there. Let's see what 30, what damage that does. You may only use direct damaging moves here, i.e. no stat changing moves, no status inducers, etc. Alright, and we're on route, what, 16? Alright, we do have a catch here, um, but what I, what, I, what I really, actually, what, the, the catch we're going to do is we're going to attempt to get this Snorlax when the time comes. Um, so we'll save that, um, but let's head through here. Let me, let me double check, make sure we're still on route 16. Yes, we are. We're still on route 16. Perfect. What I really want to do is I think this chick will give us fly, so let's uh, let's grab it. Uh, if I don't tell anyone I'm here, I might get up to you with this. See if team HMO2, or HM, yeah, yeah, that's what I said, HMO2. We're good. Uh, we're going to use this. I've got Garrus with us, so we're going to teach this to Garrus. He doesn't have an actual flying move yet, um, but, so we're going to teach this to him uh, here instead of all that. Um, so he knows Gust, Sand Attack, Quick Attack, and Whirlwind. Um, and I'm going to go ahead and get rid of... Gust, I think, because Quick Attack is priority. Um, Aaron did say that Whirlwind would be uh, allowable. Open my chain contains Flash. No. Uh, what other what other TMs do we have here? Teleport. Nope. Uh, this is this is something good, right? Oh, Thunderbolt. She's Thunderbolt to Pokemon. Luna can learn Thunderbolt. Ah, look at her. I don't think she's got very good special attack though, so we'll we'll save that. Rest may some, be something we use. Okay, that's everything we got on hand. But, so there we go. In 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 anticipation of the gym today, we've got now a flying move on Fal- or er, not Falco, uh, that was the last guy. Um, on Garrus. And, uh, oop, nope. We need to cut. I guess we could, we could just fly back. Let's do it, why not? Um, we've unlocked, uh, we've unlocked there. So, um, because of Surge's badge, we're actually able to fly, and now we have the HM so we can do it. That'll open up. Uh, a number of free heals on the other side of town, or on the other side of the region. Um, speaking of which, we used a free heal here in Celadon, so we only have three left. Um, okay, so that works. Um, I do want to say, okay, so let's. Uh, we could go up to the top of the the um, the apartment on top of the uh, department store, but um, really, I don't think I want to use Eevee as my. Um, as my encounter for this town. I think I want to take a look at what they've got available here in the uh, game corner. Coin case is required. Uh, no, it's easy. He's in a, he's in the, the place down here. He's drinking away his sorrows or something. Uh, this guy, right? Go ahead, laugh. I flat out busted. No more slots for me. I'm going straight. Here, I won't be needing this anymore. Yeah, there we go. So we got the coin case from this guy, and then we can go take a look. Because of, in this generation, Eevee can only evolve into Umbreon, or not Umbreon, if it was Umbreon, it can only evolve into Jolteon, Vaporeon, or Flareon. Um, I don't know that that's really going to be the best bet. Um, so, when, when, otherwise we can get a Scyther, Pinsir, or Porygon, well... Oh no, yeah, there's multiple here. Oh, Wigglytuff, why is Wigglytuff so expensive? Abra, we can get an Abra, Vulpix, Wigglytuff. And or look out, bud. Look out! Get out of the way! You're blocking the counter! Here we go. 
This might be TMs. Yes, TM23, TM15, and TM50. I think one of these is flamethrower. I need I need to look into that. We'll we'll deal with that uh, when we do rocket stuff next episode probably. Um, but I well, uh, all right. Wait, 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 wait. So we have Abra, Vulpix, or Wigglytuff. We'll probably end up going Abra if I'm honest with you, just because we've got Pikachu who knows Thunderbolt, so Jolteon, I love Jolteon, Flareon, and Vaporeon. Uh, well, at least I love Flare, or Jolteon and Vaporeon. Uh, but we've got Pikachu, and I don't intend to lose Pikachu. I think we'll probably be pretty safe with it. Uh, he's gotten pretty, Fiber's gotten pretty powerful, so I think we're going to be okay with him. Uh, so I don't want to, I don't want to get Eevee and, and count on doing Jolteon, because I don't think we'll need it. Uh, Flareon, we've got, uh, we've got, uh, 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 what's his what's his name? Morden. We've got Morden, um, who's a great fire type. And even if Morden goes down, Flareon's definitely not my next choice because Flareon's probably one of the worst fire types in the entire region. Um, so we're not gonna be doing that. Um, Vaporeon will be pretty good. Vaporeon's got good defenses and things like that. So worst case scenario, Vaporeon would be a great option. But at the same time, there's so many water types available. Um, and, and we're going to get a, for sure, Lapras in Saffron, I believe. Um, or, or we at least have the option. We don't have to take a Pokemon in the Fighting Dojo. Um, but I think the only other Pokemon available in Saffron is the Lapras. And Lapras is a great Pokemon, so if, if Techno goes down, which again, I don't think is going to happen. Techno's got pretty good defenses and stuff too. If Techno sticks around, we don't need Vaporeon. So, I think, and you guys can tell me if you think I'm wrong, I'll, I'll wait until next episode to do this because we'll do all the Game Corner Team Rocket stuff then. Um, but I believe that Abra will probably be the way to go. We've got Abra, Vulpix, Wigglytuff, and uh, Scyther, Pinsir, Porygon. I think if we can get an Abra and be gentle with him enough to get him up to a Kadabra and then an Alakazam potentially... I think that's going to be the way to go. Um, in, in this generation, Psychics are so useful, and if, if we can just rip through things with one of them, that's that's something special there. So, uh, I think that's what we're going to do for our encounter here. Let's, let's do ourselves a favor, and we're going to go into the department store here, take a look at the TMs that they're offering, um, and other stuff like that. Let's see, this guy is going to be... Crap. Um... Are they going to tell me what this is? Uh, let's buy one of the cheap ones. Okay, no. Uh, give me one second. I'm going to pull up a list and we'll see what we're looking at here. One second. Okay, here we go. So the all the TMs available in the Pokemon, or the department store here today are Double Team, which is this one, Reflect, Razor Wind... I'm not really sure what that is. Um, might be a flying move? I doubt it in first gen, but it's possible. Uh, Horn Drill, Egg Bomb, and Mega Punch, Mega Kick, Takedown, and Submission. So that's disappointing a little bit. A little bit. Uh, let's take a look. Now, where? What was? what were the ones that were there in the... Um, oh, come on. You're not going to list those out? Uh 23, 15, and 50. Let's take a look at that. 23 is Dragon Rage. 15 is Hyper Beam. And 50 is Substitute. Okay, it's crap. I was thinking we could buy a fire move here. TM38 we get from Cinnabar Island Gym. So at the very least, we'll have... Well, that's like the second to last gym, though. That's not really useful. That's the only fire TM that exists in the first generation, though. Interesting, interesting. Okay, well, uh, there we go, I guess. So we're not gonna be able to get a better move, at least until Blaine, uh, for for Morden there. Um, none of these really sounded especially interesting, so I'm probably gonna hold off on that. Let's see what other kind of options we've got here in the Pokemart. Um, great balls, we've got super potions. Let's go ahead and, uh, actually, let's go ahead and check our rolls, because I feel like I do have a roll let me see if there's a region-wide rule that says, um, uh, you're limited to four heals, pick it up, uh, region-wide. You may now only use three items in battle, no more fleeing. Okay, so it doesn't seem that I have any region-wide rules that restrict 
for some reason I thought I did. But I guess I've just had enough different rolls that have messed with what I can buy. Um, Route nine. Let's let's actually we got we got to take a quick second because on Route nine we rolled. You may now only buy up to seven items at the next mart. Let me make sure that this is not the next mart. Uh, let's let's quickly. Where's my time map? There we go. All right. Two, three, four. Five, six, nine. Okay, crap. Because I don't believe. Is there a is there a a route or a Pokemon in Lavender Town? Let's let's double check. We got it. We got. I apologize for me doing so much checking in this episode. I really do, but we need to confirm. If there is a Pokemart in Lavender Town. And there is. There is a Pokemart in Lavender Town. Okay, so we can buy stuff here. We can buy as much as we can afford here. There we go. We gotta make sure we're keeping our rules right. Because if we screw up a rule, then we gotta do a punishment roll. And then we lose a Pokemon or something else. And it's not worth doing. So, um, we've got all kinds of stuff. Let's buy... We're going into the grass gym. So let's buy... By a couple of wakings. There we go. By a couple of paralyzed heals. Great. Um, Brian heals. We won't need antidotes. We'll take a couple of. Okay. So now we're pretty good there. Um, Great ball. We'll buy a few of here. Let's buy ten. Yeah, that'll be fine. And then we'll use the rest of the money for super potions. So we need almost as much as we get. Perfect. We can get 12 super potions with what we've got. That pretty much wipes us out, but we do have a ton of... Whoa. Um, what? Wait, what? Hold on. Wait, my bag full? What's going on here? Yeah, you can't carry any more items. All right, so we need to sell some stuff. So let's do that. Um, let's sell... Sell this moonstone. No. Um. Do, 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 do. Some of these TMs are worthless, right? Let's let's quickly, quickly, quickly. Gosh, I'm so sorry, guys. Um. Do 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 do. Let's one of a couple of these are not great. We can rest. We can probably sell Thunderbolt. I'm holding on to. What was this one? Oh, teleport. We can definitely sell. All right. So. And we can always run back to the PC and deposit some, I guess. It's so dumb that they limit the bag size, though. Um, all right, so this, we'll sell that for some cash. That'll work out nicely. Uh, now that gets rid of a single line item. Is that all we needed to do to buy potions? Or do we need to buy, get rid of like 10 items? I don't know how this works necessarily. Okay, so we were able to buy those. Now we still have 1,900, so let's uh, buy two more. There we go. Okay, perfect. Perfect. That works for me. Um, let's see what other... Well, let's... Um, I think that's going to be good. I think that's going to be good. Uh, we, we checked at the TMs, which is really what I was interested in. Um, I think we are going to wait. And you guys, you guys let me know. Um, but I think we're probably going to use the Game Corner uh, for our Pokemon. Let me know which of those Game Corner Pokemon you would like me to get. And or if you think, no, you really should get the Eevee, um, I can do that too. But we'll worry about that next episode. For now, we're going to head right in and take care of the uh, gym here. I think it's about that time. About that time. I'm so excited to have Fly. That opens up a lot of free heals. Oh wait, no, we got to talk to the perverted old man. <laughs> this gym is great. It's full of women. All right, um, so there we go. We got the pervert. Uh, oh yeah, I forgot how minimal all these places were back in the day. Um, okay, uh, so Fiverr's up front because Fiverr has to be. Our game mode is swapped. Um, yeah, let's switch just for OCD's sake. Put Luna at the bottom because Garrus is a higher level. All right, let's take these chicas on. You are not allowed in here. I don't know how they can be allowed to do that. Have a gym where half of the population isn't allowed to compete. And I mean, I know, well, hmm, I can, uh, yeah, I can switch. That's a big deal. Let's bring Garrus out and see what Garrus uh, has in store. Gonna get wrapped right off the bat. 
Our boy Garrus, I guess. Uh, all right, fly. Let's use that. Hopefully, fly is a flying type move in this generation. Yes, it is. Super effective. Beautiful. Um, Fiber to level thirty-seven. Nice. Um, last time out, we've been. Apparently, um, apparently, someone was telling me uh, that at no point in the first generation, and perhaps onward have naturally caught Pokemon been, um, been able to be, disobey you. I don't know, it, I, <clears throat> I, I don't know if that's just first gen. I feel like I've had it happen numerous times, so I, I, I and I don't do a lot of trading, but I guess she said, the person said, it might have been Aaron, um, said that in-game trades also do it, um, affect it. So, I, I was all worried about Fiverr, you know, over-leveling and, and being disobedient, but, um, Apparently, that's not a concern. Apparently. Uh, Alright, so there we go. Let's get Morden out here. Morden's for sure going to be a long-term member of the team. Until he gets put to sleep. Ooh, woke up right away. Beautiful. boy, Morden. Alright, so let's give the dig a shot there. Save embers and stuff for if they don't... If they've got a Tangela or something. I don't remember exactly what we're expecting. Um, but we'll... Uh, Dig's probably going to be more powerful as we've seen in the past anyway. So there we go. We'll use that. And then if we get any... Uh, any pure grass types, we'll use uh, we'll use those. Uh, there we go. We'll dig again. Pulsar goes for that poison powder. Get our dig off. Nice critical hit. Attaboy, Warden. Uh, yeah. Dig it up. Dig, dig, dig. Dig, 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 dig. dig. Using that sleep powder. At this point, we'll use one ember. Crit enough to kill. Beautiful. Beautiful. Down goes Anish. Beauty sent out Bellsprout. Wow, she's still going. Let's see what one Ember will do, just for curiosity's sake. Yeah, still not enough to kill. Alright. Probably finish it off with a scratch at this point. So let's see. Scratch, there we go. Critical hit. Perfect. Morgan grew to level 27. Nice! Poor Beauty, my makeup, all that kind of stuff. Alright, so, okay, we got two more trainers on the sides here. Get those going. Oh yeah, we got trainers got lore in here. Perfect, 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 perfect. Awesome. Beauty wants to fight. She sends out Bell Sprout. So yeah, lots of poison types. Um, let's get Garrus out. Let him get the experience too. Again with the wraps. Oh, come on, Garrus. You can do it, buddy. You can do it. There we go. Fly on up. Hopefully this will one-shot, so we don't have to worry about more wrapping. Perfect, perfect, work it. Gara's got 268 HP, Bellsprout. Flying on up. I believe I can fly. I believe I can touch the sky. Alright, Bellsprout is dead, perfect. One more guy down, Gara's going to level. Very cool. Very, very cool. Alright. Poor Grass-type Jim. Way too many things that can kill you in this generation. And especially because we caught Pidgeotto on route... What, what, what route was that? Route 7? 8? I think it went route 8 and then 7. Anyway, we caught, we caught Pidgeotto over there, but I think you can get Fire Pokemon over there as well. So, not only do you have it, you know, the potential of having, you know, a Fire Starter, but you also have... Um, uh, what am I doing? Uh, Morden? Uh, do I want? Who do I? Yeah, let, let's let Morin take care of the Bulbasaur here. Um, so not only do you have potential for your starter, but you also have tons of flying types, tons of bug types, poison types, which most of these grass types are poison type as well, so it's not so much of an issue, but man, the grass types really don't have a lot to work with in these first, uh, well, really ever, but especially in these first generations until you start getting some good type variation in there. Um... More than digging a hole. Using that dig. There we go. Hitting the leech life. Let's scratch it up. And then we'll get out of here. Oh, right. Well, the battle's over. Well, there we go. We got out. Perfect. Uh, now let's um, get some. Let's cut. Yeah, so we got three more trainers. All right. And then we get the gym battle. Perfect. Get all kinds of grass types in here. Now, I've yet to see, like, an execute or something. Which, I mean, yeah, we, we haven't come across an execute yet, but I feel like I should... Yeah, I feel like I would like to see one. Um, do, 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 do. Let's bring Luna in. 
Things paralyzed. Let's see what let's see what Luna can do. Fully paralyzed. Perfect. Go for the body slam. Oh yeah, at a girl Luna. Doing work. All right. Next one comes in is a gloom. Just keep the body slams up. Let's see what we can do. We get paralyzed. It's okay. Let's let's just let's see how it plays out. I think Luna can absorb most hits. Ooh, with a crit. At a girl. Even even with paralysis, we're getting the crits. Which, um, somebody was saying it's it's calculated based on speed, um, so that's interesting. Um, pretty interesting that a paralyzed Pokemon just got a crit, well, uh, if it's calculated based on speed. Okay, Leech Seed back out, Luna attacks. Okay, we're, we are gonna switch her out here, though. Um, not worth losing her over. Let's bring Garrus back out. See if we can't finish off with a quick attack. Nope, we cannot. Oh, and the poison. All right, we're gonna have to use some some items here after the battle. So we feed a cool trainer female. All right, let's um. This is why we stock up. This is why we stock up. Um, antidotes. We got five of those. Perfect. Uh, how many paralyzed heals did I get? I got two. Let's use. One, and then let's use a couple of potions. Well, no, let's, uh, we'll, we'll potion up before the gym leader. Let's, uh, let's finish off what we can here. We still got a couple of Pokemon that are reasonably strong. We don't need to waste potions just yet, but we'll make sure we're strong enough before the gym leader, and then we'll, we'll head out. Uh, let's go for the slam. Now that I know Fiber's not gonna disobey, we'll just go ahead and kill this thing. Get all the experience for Fiber, and then he'll never leave me. Um, all right, let's Thunder Wave. Oh my gosh, did you guys just hear that? That was the puppy. He's yipping in his sleep. That's hilarious. Sucked in help from Fiber. All right, uh, Morden's pretty good still. Let's get Morden back out here. Oh my god, he's so adorable. He's dreaming and he's yipping in his sleep. Oh, he's so cute. All right, Morden, wake up, buddy. He's going to town. Come on, Morden. Wake up, buddy. Make up. Wake up! You can do it! You can do it, Morden! There we go. Morden woke up. Fantastic. Alright. Uh, Ember. Let's see what that does. About half. A little over half. Dig it up here and finish off. Looms fully... Oh, wow! That didn't finish? That's shocking. Thank God we didn't get sleep powdered again, though. Alright. Gloom is dead. Everybody's dead. All right, perfect. Last is done. Um, how we doing? I think we. I think we can do this. I think we can do this. I think we can finish off this last turn. Ooh, wait. Who's paral poisoned? Is Fiverr poisoned? I forget who got poisoned. That might be an issue. We might need to look into that. Oh, there we go. She's got an executute. Ex executute. Executute. The farting Pokemon. This Pokemon wears a suit and walks around, leaving noxious gas all around. The Executute. Um, alright. Execute. Execute. There we go. Anyway, paralyzed. Um, let me go ahead. Bring in Garrus. Goes for that Reflect. Ah, taking out the physical damage. Which I believe Fly, fly is physical. Because I'm pretty sure that every special type... The types used to be broken up like all flying type attacks were, you know, special or physical. Um, and it, I believe that all the special types are were given EV Lucians. So you had your electric, your water, your fire, your grass, your ice, your uh, psychic, your dark. Uh, those were all special before they, I think in the third generation was when they made that split. Uh, or when they broke up, um, different moves could have different... Uh, you know, special or otherwise. Um, let's use Super Potion on Morden. We've got plenty of these for now. We're gonna have tons of money after this probably too with all these lovely ladies giving it up um, when we defeat them there. So that works out nicely. Um, we probably, let's also, we have, we've got a couple antidotes, right? Let's use one more. Those are cheap enough to replace. Fiverr gets cured. Okay guys. Here we go, we are ready to take on the gym leader, so let's do it up now. Hello, lovely weather, isn't it? It's so pleasant. Oh dear, I must have dozed off. Welcome. 
My name is Erica. I'm the leader of Celadon Gym. I teach the art of flower arranging. My Pokemon are of the grass type. Oh, I'm sorry. I had an idea that you wished to challenge me. Very well, but I shall not lose. Should like all the other girls were like, what are you doing here? Ew, boys! Shouldn't Erica be a little more concerned? All right, so she does have the Tangela. So let's lead off with the Thunder Wave. Get this thing paralyzed. Um, going for that Mega Drain. Maybe, ooh, does she give us a Giga Drain HM or something? Or TM? That would be exciting. Um, she, man, that, that freaking Tangela, man, did work. Let's bring in Morden. I, I don't like it that it covers up the, the level, because I kind of now don't know what level this thing is in order to be worried. But let's throw up some embers. Constrict at least doesn't lock us in. Does bind? Yeah, bind does, apparently. So you have, in this generation, we have bind, constrict, and wrap. That seems excessive. They all are basically the exact same move. I wonder what the logic behind that was. Morden doing good work here, though. Could use one of your patented crits here, Morden. Ooh, there we go. All right, beautiful. Tangela goes down. Fiber gets experience. Morden gets experience. Erica sends in Weeping Bell. Let's dig. Level 32. Nice. That'll be some nice experience for us. Acid might hurt a lot. Okay. Um, let's get Garrus out here. Bell use acid. Garrus, how are you gonna take that? A little bit better. A little bit better. Garrus will fly up high. How you gonna do? How you gonna do? Doesn't kill, but not bad. Not bad. I'll take it. Garrus was a good addition to the team last episode and ahead of this this gym, and especially allowing us to fly now. That's definitely gonna be useful. Uh, sends out gloom. We'll let Garrus finish it up. Um, at least until Morden evolves, I think that. Oh wait, what did he miss? Okay, let me, um, let me heal. Because I don't think, if, if, if the fly doesn't kill, I don't think uh, he's going to survive another one of those. Alright. Ooh, and Garrus' defense is falling, so that's also an ideal. There we go, not bad. Whoo! Okay, we need, to, we need to bring somebody else in. Um... Sari should be neutral damage with acid, right? Oh! Oh, it's a crit. Not very effective. Um, let's use cut. Whoo! Okay. Um, I obviously have to heal Sari. Man, this thing's just throwing up acids like it's its job. Not very effective, and it still does, like, almost... Yikes. Huh. Fiverr, you're gonna have to come in, bud. You can take it. Oh, with the sleep powder and the... I'm not messing with that. Let's, uh, wake up, Fiverr. Can't sleep on the job. Pedal dance. Ooh. Ooh! Buddy, this gloom, man! Crashing about. What is this nonsense? What is what is happening here? All right. Oh, fiber. Oh, I can't. I can't. Okay. Confused. Hurt self and confusing. Okay. Thunderbolt. Even though it's resisted, might kill here. So let's just go for it. Nope. Not enough. Not enough. Oh, and the super potion. Dang it. All right. Get the thunder wave going. Um, okay, again, we have another Awakening, right? We bought a couple of those, which is good. Wake up, Fiber. Gloom is confused, no more. Enemy Gloom used acid. Ouch. Oh, not enough. Oh, crap, another freaking... <sighs> Fiber woke up. Gloom is fully paralyzed. Slam it. Thank you. That better be the last Pokemon she's got. That thing was a monster. Wow! Never had so much trouble killing a Gloom! Especially with two super effective Pokemon. Yikes! <sighs> Even with the a couple of episodes, we got a decent couple of levels uh, in Rock Tunnel. I probably need to go back there and grind a bit because, man, we are severely underleveled overall uh, at this point. Fiverr was almost like the only one who was at a place where he needed to be. 
Um, and also in last Pokemon, you, he wasn't even overleveled at that point. Uh, please take this with you. T TM21 contains Mega Drain. So not Giga. So definitely putting that... Well, I'll wait and I'll wait and check and see if Sari will learn it naturally. And if not, it's definitely going on Sari. If it is, I might save it uh, just in case. Um, but all right, there we go. Wow, that gym gym battle, man. I was like, oh, Erica's gonna be the easiest one of them all. Blah blah blah. blah. Like that gloom. That gloom, though. All right. Uh, all right. Let's head around. I am gonna go. Yeah, we're gonna use one of our heals. We'll still have two here in town, and we've got flies, so we can go get to other areas too if we need them. But we definitely need to heal after that whole deal. Um, but yeah, anyway, guys, I think that's gonna be it for today. Thank you guys so much for watching. I've been Torment the Grain. You guys have been great. Make sure those likes, comments, subscriptions for me, guys. Let me know what you guys are thinking on uh, the Pokemon that we should get um, here in Celadon City. We have numerous choices. You guys are pretty familiar with them at this point, so I'll let you guys just go ahead and take care of that for me. Let me know what you guys want to see. And, uh, yeah, I'll see you guys then. As always, I've been Torment the Grain. You guys have been great. Make sure those likes, comments, subscriptions, guys, and I'll see you all next time. Have a good one!